Hello internet boys and girls, Gary Shutt here again showing you some Van Halen lessons. This one is going to be uh, some of his signature tricks and noises and squeals. That uh, There is an interview of Eddie talking about his mom saying, Eddie, why do you make those horrible uh, screaming sounds? And he, so, and he says, well, it bought your house, didn't it? So, thought that that was funny. Anyway, uh, first we're going to do the horse. So it's... You're gonna, uh, anyway, this is not for beginners. If you're learning Van Halen stuff, you should be at least uh, somewhat advanced. So I'm not gonna slowly detail stuff for all the beginners out there because uh, this is not meant for you guys. Hopefully you get better. Pinch harmonic is when you take the pick and you, and you get some skin with it. By the way, that's the uh, intro to some hardline song. I believe that's a rhythm, rhythm from a red red car. That's a pinch harmonic. You pinch the skin on your thumb with the pick. And how to do the uh, EVH? Uh, horsey squeal. You, you hit one of those, you bend it up, and you grab your whammy bar and you pull it down a bit. That's how you do that. So there's one. Another one is the uh, the tap harmonic uh, triad thing. So we're gonna do this on a C. You're going to tap your finger, not not an eruption tap, but just a a slight tap on on the uh, the G note, the C note, the E note, and you can also do it on this other E note. If you do it on the B flat, there's another harmonic in there too. So. You can also bend your C. That's that's another eighty thing. You can also take the octave one, bend it up another whole step above that. So you got your root, your second, bend it up to the third. That's another eighty thing. Another one is if you, uh, he likes his G string for some reason. So anyway, G string, you're gonna play the fourth fret and the second fret. Pull off like this. Okay, now the way that he did this was he did it on his palm. I tend to do it with my middle finger because there's, a, there's, there's, there's less fret, there's, there's less flesh to mute the string with. So you let the string ring out a bit, but but still mute it. So that... So there's that. See, it, if you do it with your palm, it's a little more muted. So I tend to do it with, my, with the bottom of my little finger. Which is that little noise coming out of the solo for somebody to get me a doctor. I hope those helped. Hope you learned some new stuff and make some new noises and uh, bother your family and neighbors for many, many hours. Uh, my name is Gary Shutt. Thanks for tuning in. Please like. Share and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate you all. Thank you. Bye. Today's guitar was strung up using Blue Magic strings. I was their first Floyd Rose user and they told me to try and break these strings, so I tried. I steve by the hell out of that whammy bar every night and it took me 11 gigs to finally break a string. That's a three hour a night show. 11 gigs later, finally broke a string.
They last longer, they sound better longer, try them. This guitar already has a few shows under its belt. And it's still good to go. And if you're asking, yes, acoustic strings are available, seven string guitars are available, and now bass strings are available. Do yourself a favor and get yourself a set right here at bluemagicmusic.com.